Welcome back for today's college basketball pick video play for March 19, 2019. In this one, I'm going to be talking about this NIT matchup between South Dakota State and Texas. If you're interested in getting all of our college basketball picks throughout March Madness, you can check those out over at stumpthespread.com, which is linked down in the video description. Heading into this one, we have the home team Texas coming in as rather sizable favorites here, giving about nine and a half points. The road team, South Dakota State, has to be disappointed that they didn't get into the NCAA tournament. They were clearly the best team in the Summit League, standing 24-8 and overall, 14-2 and within conference. But they came up well short within their conference tournament, actually losing in their first tournament game within league tournament action, losing that one by a final of 76-79 to against a Western Illinois opponent that South Dakota State actually completely dominated twice during the regular season, defeating... Western Illinois by finals of 86 to 66, as well as 100 to 58. So losing to a team like that, that you already so thoroughly defeated twice, was very disappointing for the Jack Rabbits. But South Dakota State on the year, very impressive numbers. They're a team that plays with a lot of offensive potency and pace, averaging 85 points per game while giving up around 73. So a positive point differential of plus 12. Now the Jack Rabbits, perhaps not quite as consistently solid throughout the course of the regular season as many expected this team to be they had their hiccups every now and then but if you look at the whole scope of what this team was able to do in general they were pretty strong having forward veteran Mike Dom on their roster is clearly the reason why everyone thought South Dakota State was going to be one of the top mid-majors this season and Dom again this year averaging a ton of points uh, putting up 25.3 points per contest so they're going on the road taking on a Texas Longhorns team that's right at 500 with their record 16 and 16 overall and a team that was fading down the stretch run losing five out of their last six games and given the step back that Texas took down the stretch is probably why they didn't get into the NCAA tournament and even though this Texas team is right at 500 with their record they actually did pick up some pretty solid resume building wins if we take a look back at the non-conference this is a Texas team that defeated opponents like North Carolina and Purdue won in three seeds respectively in the NCAA tournament, but then also losing at home against an opponent like Radford is just a microcosm of what we saw from the Longhorns this year where they had very high highs, but also some head-scratching, inexcusable defeats along the way. Now, Texas, in terms of their numbers, averaging 71 points per game, giving up 67, so a positive point differential of plus four, and you'd expect Texas not to have as good of a point differential as somebody like a South Dakota State, given the tougher schedule that they went against. But we feel like South Dakota State has the offensive potential to actually make things interesting in this contest. And the fact that we're getting this Jackrabbits offense with nine and a half points against a team like Texas that was very up and down and played in a lot of competitive games, even against some lower tier teams, we feel like this has the ingredients to be a close matchup. So with that being the case, we're going to go ahead side with South Dakota State getting the nine and a half points as the better value bet. If you agree, give the video a thumbs up. Disagree, give it a thumbs down. As always, you can check out all of our college basketball picks over at stumpthespread.com. Subscribe to our YouTube channel, and we hope to see you guys back here for our next video.